It is a sentencing hearing unlike any other. I'm Courtney Terrier here in Melfort, Saskatchewan at the Kerry Vicker Community Centre for the sentencing hearing of Jiskarit Sadu. He's the truck driver involved in that deadly collision with the Humboldt Broncos bus last April. Now, many of the earlier appearances had been at the courthouse here in Melfort, but it had to be moved to this much larger venue to accommodate the number of people who wanted to speak or partake. And this morning, that sentencing hearing began with an agreement on the statement of facts. It was determined after an RCMP forensics reconstruction of the collision found that Mr. Sadu had driven his semi and two trailers through a stop sign into the oncoming path of the Humboldt Broncos bus. Attempted to slam on the brakes but was unable to avoid the collision. RCMP also determining that alcohol, drugs and distracted driving did not play a role in that collision. This morning, we also heard the first victim impact statements, these delivered by the family of Logan Boulay. His mother, Bernadine, his father, Toby, both choking back tears as they delivered somber eulogies towards their son, who they described as a born leader, an aspiring teacher, and someone who inspired others in his decision to sign his organ donor card that ultimately saved six lives. Now, we are expecting to hear from more families with victim impact statements totaling about 75 over the course of the week. The sentencing hearing expected to last up to five days. Reporting from Melfort, Courtney Terrio, City News.